Good morning and welcome to this video. Where today we're going to be replacing the hard drive on this HP Model 15-DA0511SA laptop. Um, the laptop is, has uh, 11 screws in total. Uh, there's actually a hidden one here at the back just to be aware of that. Um, some of the screws are contained behind these strips so they'll need removing first. Um, so I have removed the screws and now we're just going to get the um, chassis off so that we can replace the hard drive. Now, luckily, this one is not too difficult and is coming, popping out quite nicely. So, while I just fiddle on with this, uh, I'll be back with you in a moment. Okay, so we've gone around the case with the case removal tool, and uh, that's come off quite actually quite straightforward, which is good. So we'll just put the case to one side here, while we have a little look on the inside. Um, so not much to see on this one. Standard laptop. So we have uh, got basically um, battery here. Um, this is just your standard uh, standard battery, uh, laptop battery, uh, model HT03XL for this laptop if you need to know, uh, and standard rechargeable ion battery. Uh, we've got the hard drive here which is what we're going to be taking out today and replacing with an SSD because as you can see this is an old style mechanical hard drive. We've got memory here if you wanted to upgrade the memory, the standard memory on this model is 4 gig. Uh, if you wanted to upgrade that, you've got an extra slot here for extra memory. Uh, I believe this laptop will take up to 16 gig. Um, and then you've got the CPU and other components here, as well as a slot uh, for a disk drive there on some of the on some of the models of this particular laptop. Worth noting, if you wanted to install an M2 chip to give yourself a secondary um, drive, that can be installed here. Um, so you could actually um, have one drive here uh, which would be your um, 2.5 inch and then one drive here which would be your M2 chip um, so double capacity here on this laptop okay so let's go ahead and get the drive out there are two screws holding this in And it looks like this is just a little bracket here that's holding this this drive in. There we go, just a bit fiddly to get out. And uh, here we have the hard drive now, which, which should just sort of, you just lift it up ever so slightly and just pull that out okay there we have the old mechanical drive there okay so today we're going to be installing a V series integral SSD um, this one's on 120 gig um, so again you might want to utilize the extra M2 slot for space if you need it um, so we'll be installing that Installing that now. I'll just pause while I get this case off. So we're going to pop the new SSD in now. So occasionally you will get a bracket like this. In this instance, I found the bracket uh, doesn't really support it well, so just slide that in and then pop the bracket.
Okay, so that's the hard drive installed now. Um, simply a case of putting the case back on and, uh, and then booting into the OS. Thanks for watching.